LGBT community, they are incredible. And you should see how they've come out in, in full force for my father every single day. I'm part of that community and we love the man. Eric Trump says he's part of the LGBT community, confusing everyone on the internet over his statement. Did he just come out of the closet? We're not sure. From Rich TV Studios in Hollywood, it is Andy to break down everything you need to know about the Trump campaign maybe, but let's get into it. But before we do, make sure you like and subscribe to keep up to date with all of our latest videos. But let's talk about how Eric Trump came onto Fox News and made a statement that was kind of confusing to a lot of people like me, especially. On Tuesday, September 29th, Eric Trump appeared on the Fox and Friends segment discussing with hosts about the quote, secret Trump voters. The panel discussed Brett Stevens' column in the New York Times. One of the secret voters is a lesbian woman in her 50s who will vote for President Donald Trump in November despite being a registered Democrat. The woman, identified as Chris, doesn't share her last name fearing judgment of her fellow colleagues. She told Times, being a lesbian who's voting for Trump is like coming out of the closet again. But just when you figure out the plot couldn't get any thicker, it does, and it does get thicker. Fox and Friends host Ansley Anhart goes for the gold question and asks Eric Trump, are you counting on this person, on the secret voter? To which we receive Eric's fabulous yet subtle confession. So are you yeah. counting on this person, on the secret voter? Ainsley, that person's there. I'm telling you, I see it every day. The LGBT community, they are incredible. And you should see how they've come out in, in full force for my father every single day. I'm part of that community and we love the man. And thank you for protecting our neighborhoods and thank you for, for protecting our cities. Aside from the possibility of him potentially coming out on national television, is a response that we kind of laugh about in a way, or at least the internet did, and they poked fun at least of what he said. This user attaches a photo to their tweet showcasing the reaction of the LGBT community by saying, quote, the gays after hearing Eric Trump say that the LGBT community loves his dad. Another one points to their clip with the captions, quote, question, do you accept Eric Trump with open arms into the LGBT community? The gays. But there are many people in the LGBTQ plus community who seem to deny Eric's application, I guess, to be a part of the community and be gay. Erica says, we the gay community have had an emergency meeting and we have rejected Eric Trump's application. This one tags RuPaul's iconic sashay away gif with the captions. I know we gays are a very inclusive community, but Eric Trump? Another one tweets, we the gays reject Eric Trump. Bye. And of course, some new reactions from our newly rejected candidate, Eric Trump, for the gay community. The tweet reads, breaking, Eric Trump either A, just came out as gay on national television, good for him, B, is so stupid that he doesn't realize that he accidentally suggested he's gay on national TV, but also good for him. Linda here says, not sure if Eric Trump just came out or if he thinks LGBT stands for looters, grifters, burglars, Trumpers. And finally, this last Twitter user tweets, Eric Trump saying he's a part of the LGBT community is like me saying I'm a part of the fantasy football community. I might think I know what a tight end and a wide receiver are, but I would be sorely mistaken. So the question is, does Eric Trump have any chance of being a part of this community if he seems so by mistake even? But you let us know in the comments down below. I find it funny, but I obviously don't know what his intentions were. But for more social media daily, head to whatstrike.com and we'll see you real soon.